Hey everybody, welcome, 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 welcome to the family meeting. My name is Emery. I am the owner and inventor of uh, Family Hair Care, the all-in-one complete hair care system in the jar. Let me go ahead and bring up our guest tonight. We have our family here. Hey everybody, how are you guys doing this week? Great, great. Good to see you. Good to see you guys too. What's happening? Let's do our hey, greeting. Hey, just our in there. Hey. <laughs> your hair looks beautiful good 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 so everybody if you're watching on social media please share uh you'll have a chance to win fifty dollars a fifty dollar gift card to our store tonight just share and then type in the comment section i share and we'll go ahead and look at you guys later um let's go ahead and get started uh first one go ahead and start off with our tip of the week so if you're using family hair care and you're saying or if you have shrinkage in general um, this is our tip before, but I'm going to reiterate it. A lot of people say, hey, I have shrinkage still. What am I doing wrong? What can I do? Let me go ahead and demonstrate. So um, usually when people have shrinkage, um, their hair, they want it you know, to fall and be elongated and stuff, and they kind of get this. So instead, they kind of want this. This is the curl of their dreams, but they get this, and they say, well, my, I have shrinkage, or my hair is dry, or my hair does this, my hair does that. All you have to do, and we demonstrated last, this is the curl from last week, is just you can make your own curls with this product. It does everything. So let me go ahead and demonstrate again how we got our hair from, you know, to this, from this, okay? So, can, okay, so the first thing all you have to do is just take a section of hair. It's super, super simple. This formula is like literally uh, foolproof. Just take a section of hair and from the, you know, uh, you know, tip to the root just go ahead and rub some on there and you're going to just let it fall down and you can control how big and how small your curls are that way if your hair you know does not traditionally curl you can just clump some together and put it down and then once it dries you're going to have a nice beautiful curl like this it's going to be coated and once your natural hair texture you know starts to come in a little bit and instead of getting that shrinkage you're going to get a nice curl pattern and it's going to be elongated and you can make it you know from there as big as as small as you want as far as like your hair so that's the tip of the week does everybody understand does anybody have any questions let me bring you guys back up any questions anybody no okay great 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 well let's go ahead and get our update so we're doing our um new year healthy start in our photogenic uh i'm sorry in our family hair care facebook group every day we're all posting you know we're trying to drink more water we're drinking you know a gallon of water a day um we are also um in here hang on one second just give me one second here we go. We're drinking a gallon of water a day, and we're also, you know, cutting out sugar, alcohol from our diets, and things of that nature. Trying to eat, you know, clean. And what's the third, the, the uh, third thing that we're doing, guys? Oh, and we're trying to get our steps in. We're trying to do a um, target of ten thousand steps a day. Um, so we're all doing that together and showing our progress. Does anybody have any good news Thursday or an update on their New Year healthy start for us, so we can encourage each other? Any progress? I do. Okay. Hi, I Martha. Do. How are you today? Go ahead, Martha. <laughs> I've done so much better with my water. Um, with the, um, I try to be cognizant of take drinking water, but this has really helped yes. doing it as a group. So my reward for my uh, water intake. I'm ordering a new bottle. I see your nice bottle, Emery. So oh, thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. So thanks for doing thanks for doing the challenge. No, thank you. Uh, it, it it's really motivating. You know, when I wake up in the morning, I go to the group. I see you guys are already up and have worked out. You guys are eating good, posting your stuff. So it's very very motivating. And I'm glad that we're all getting the benefit at the beginning of the year. Uh, anybody else want to give us an update? Just start talking. It's fine. Well, I'm just. Piggybacking along on Martha, yes, I'm drinking more water, but I'm being more cognitive of it to mark my water down. Every time I have eight ounces, I mark it down because otherwise I get on the ping pong table and I lose I lose my thoughts and I'm just <laughs> all over the place and I will have consumed the whole gallon and 
been marked down, but I get my water in. That's awesome. And I get my steps. Good. Good, good. Yeah. Okay. Anybody else? I have been also um, getting better with drinking water. Mm -hmm. And um, I was kind of slacking with um, working out. I have a fit on app. So I picked that back up. And I also do Zumba twice a week. So mm -hmm. I'm getting there. Awesome. Great. Well, good job. Keep up the good work. And if anybody is not in our Facebook group, it's a very motivating place. You can come there. You know, everybody's glowing first thing in the morning. They're up being active. You know, hairstyles and health. It's just, it's, it's, uh, it's just a lot of positive, you know, positive energy. So if you're not there, get there. Um, it's, you know, at Family Hair Care um, across all platforms. But, you know, our Facebook group is just really a gem. Um, if anybody, you know, yeah, it's a gem if you don't know about it. Okay, uh, anybody else want to go ahead? Any good news or any updates on your New Year Healthy Start? Okay, well, no worries at all. So um, for all those that are in our uh, Facebook group, we know that right now we have a our New Year Healthy Start giveaway going on right now. So this week, um, each day you can post your three different goals, which are your steps, your water intake and you know eating cleaner if not clean is totally fine we just want everybody to just make initiative to do better nobody has to be perfect but you know you post once a day here's my water here's my steps i took you know or here's me taking some steps or and then here's my me eating healthy and then you know three posts a day and at the end of the week we're going to pick one winner to win not only um a blend jet portable blender donated you know brand new by uh rhonda our resident just everybody's one of everybody's favorite cousins so she wanted everybody you know to be healthier at the beginning of the year so we have a blend jet and we have a 90-day supply of family hair care uh you know three jars of you know greatness and we have the 90-day hair challenge so if you're having any issues with your scalp you know any recession any alopecia any balding any itching you know or your hair my hair is breaking off my hair is not like it used to be why can't i get my hair to like other people's hair we take you step by step you know what i'm saying week by week we show you all the utensils that we use all the tools and we just give you everything you know this is how you do this this is how you do that and you get to win that if you post so go in our group you know post your healthy activity and you know we want you to even be better so you know, if like the God said, if you take one step, I'll take two. So, you know, if you come here, post to be healthy, we're going to give you some incentive to keep going. So that is going on this week and it ends Sunday. Does anybody have any questions about that? Okay. So let me tell you guys, family hair care has really been a blessing for me. Um, I told you guys, I used to, you know, uh, travel a lot and let me just close this because I see a big reflection. Okay, great. I used to travel a lot, guys, and I used to have, like, all these hair products to take with me. Now, in my hair cabinet, let me tell you guys what's in my hair cabinet. This, my family hair care. And for guys, if you guys don't know about family hair care and what it does, this one product replaces your hair cleansers, your deep conditioners, your leave-in conditioners, your oil, your oil treatments your anti frizz serums, your detanglers, your uh, sealers, your gels, blowout creams, growth serum, edge control, twist manipulation, dread products, wave products. It, this does it all. So this is the only product that I use. And then I have all my styling tools in an old family hair care jar. And then I just have my water bottle. This is like literally my whole space for all my styling products and my utensils. And I, if I'm going to travel, I'm going to throw this stuff in the bag really quick and be out. It's just like the easiest thing in the world. And not to mention my hair has never, ever, ever been healthier. Look at my hair, okay? And then this is a formula that is home grown we started making this in our kitchen before we had a factory it's all natural ingredients it's no hair transplants it's no um eight step in you know eight step growth systems it's no doctor's appointments and getting you know shots and it, it, you know it's none of that guys it's just great ingredients that are prepared and they work really really well to achieve you know 
the uh, result. And then we couple that with, you know, some really, really great hair education uh, for you guys. So um, that is pretty much uh, tonight. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys. Well, does anybody have any, any questions about anything I just said so far? Let's just go ahead and start there. And I'm really, just, um, go ahead. I'm sorry. Right. Yep. Go ahead. Uh, this is Erica. Hey, yes, wait, 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 wait. We don't acknowledge the family hair care background. <laughs> yes. yes. I was so happy to go shopping today and be able to walk down the hair care aisle and not have to stand there and wonder, okay, is this going to work for my hair? Is this going to... I, I knew I had that one product at home. I didn't have to grab any shampoo. I didn't have to grab anything. I knew that one PHC product worked on my hair. And I was it was just, I was just so happy to not have to stand there and wonder what to pick out for my hair. Yeah, I, I totally get that. And then, like, this is kind of how I wrecked my hair before. When I would just see, like, everything just sounds so good. This one product does this. It just makes some, it brings in moisture. It has this plant that's from this country that just does all. So I'm trying all this stuff, and then nothing works consistently. I have, like, products over products over products. And not to mention, I used to spend, I have to, like, wash my hair every week. And I would spend a whole day every week just conditioning my hair, deep conditioning, trying to get it together. And then... It looked really, really good, but it wasn't healthy. Like, you know, it looked good to everybody who, except the people who braided my hair and stuff. They were like, oh, you got some, like, your uh, scalp is flaky, you know, and stuff. But, you know, with one product, when, like, when I come up with one product to do everything, no more itchy scalp, my hair was grown. I was balding. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> right. I have hair now. Like, I used to stay up at night worrying about my hair. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Worrying about, you know, I used to stay up, stay up at night worrying about, you know what I'm saying, if, if, if I got a meeting tomorrow, how's my hair going to look? You know what I'm saying? Or if I bought my hair, you know, how can I hide this bald spot or whatever? You know, you don't have to do any of that anymore with this product. So this is really, really, really phenomenal. Thank you so much for that, Erica. I truly appreciate it. You're welcome. Okay. Anybody else? Any questions or comments? Okay, we're going to go ahead and get right into it. So we know three weeks ago live, I went ahead and did my bun uh, for the first time in front of you guys. So this bun I have in my hair, we're talking about how good my hair looks. This will be wash day, you know, for a lot of people. It's th three weeks in, so I'm going to take it out of my bun and show you guys how my hair looks, you know, because um, I'm kind of have a dual purpose, okay? A lot of people are asking us in the group, how do I clean my hair with family hair care? This is liquid gold. You do not want to put this on your hair and then wash it out. That's just a waste, okay? What you want to do is put this on your hair heavily on your wash day at the beginning of the week or at the beginning of the month or however, you know, frequently you wash your hair. And then, at, you know, my hair is still cold. So let's go ahead and take down this bun, okay? Now, I told you guys, I used to be so hypersensitive about my hair. I'll be in meetings and then I'll just like, uh, uh, they're in my hair. I hope they don't think I'm see my bald spot or I hope they don't see this or I hope my hair not flaking or one day I thought I was looking good, y'all. And then my bun just took it to the side the whole day and nobody even said nothing to me. Like now I have family hair care. I can do whatever and nothing moves, right? Yet, I have the flexibility to, I can pull a curl down. So, do you see the difference? Like, and then, like, I used to use a ton of hair products to be able to do. So, let me go and take this down for you guys. This is my bun that we had up form three weeks ago. Because you guys are like, oh, my God, my hair is so dry. I can't do this. You know, you have to put enough product on there. And we all seen how much product I put on there three weeks ago, right? It was brown, brown. So this is my hair. You guys all see the condition. So when you take down your cast, like we, we have the hair casted for three weeks, right? So I tell people I wash my hair maybe every four to six weeks. Like right now, Every week, I would do this, take down my bun, and I could do one of three things. Number one, I could, you know, stick my head under the shower, you know, make sure my scalp is moisturized, put it back together, and then wrap it back up, and I'm good for another couple of weeks, okay? Or number two, I could not put any water in it at all. My hair was casted, right? 
and I have put a lot of hair products on my hair. So I can just go ahead and take my hair dry and just like literally take it apart and let all the product, any dirt or anything else in my hair just fall out. And when I get done, my hair would be like an afro, but it would be like product free. I can just literally just take this apart, you know, and take all the product out dry. And it's like a dry clean. You can literally put a towel down in your sink, not put any water on your hair. Don't wet it at all. Just take it apart and shake all your product and any dirt or anything that's in your hair out on that towel. Does that make sense, guys? Yes. Okay. Yes. Or the third thing I can do is I can get in the shower and just get some warm water and rinse it out and then get out the shower and reapply. No shampoo needed. It does not get any easier than this. People were asking me for years, hey, can you make a shampoo? We want to buy a shampoo. Hey, can we buy, 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 buy? I don't want to do anything and take you guys' money. You know what I'm saying? Hey, can you make a travel size? Or can you make a spray, a refresher spray? Just put a little bit of this in a spray bottle with some water, and now you have a refresher spray. You know what I'm saying? I put, you know, you can do, like, this is, like, the most diverse hair care system, yet the most simplest hair care system, yet the most natural hair care system and it's patent pending. I just want to put you guys up on game. Like this is all you have to do. You don't have to spend a whole day getting your hair done. I do my hair really one day out of the whole month. And then mm -hmm. every week I get my, you know, every week I get it trimmed up and stuff. Even my barber would be like, you know, it's looking really, really good. Like I don't, and then for us fellas, you know, I don't wait until I need a haircut to get a haircut. And some ladies, you don't wait until you need your hair done and get your hair done because you don't want to be out here looking crazy and even get to that point. And with this hair product, you have the control to do that every day. I do my hair one day a month and I'm good to go. So it just gives you the freedom, the flexibility. And you can take, like I said, I can take down this, um, the whole thing if I wanted to. I don't think I did this last time, did I? Maybe not. And, you know, you can do pretty much whatever. And we have my... You guys see my hair here that, that was growing in on my side? You know, I cut this. This was used to be a little bit higher. So that hair was growing in a little bit later. This hair okay. started growing in like March of last year. So even if you said, girl, let me do a big chop. You know what I'm saying? This was in less than a year. I already have my hair right here. So, and this is just, no, if this was side hair, this would be like really right down here. So you guys... Trust the process, believe in the product. I only have used one product on my hair since 2016, and my hair has never been healthier. Since then, I've cut my hair like numerous times because it's just, it just gets so long, I can't do any, like, even, like you guys, let me just show you guys how, like this is after me just cutting it, like, so it's gonna be growing in probably in the next like three or four months, I'll show you guys again before I cut it again. Or we can just go ahead and grow it and see how long we can get it, but, one hair product that replaces everything you know what i'm saying and this is what we are gifting to you guys to me this is a miracle this is what i was looking for so you know what i'm saying once i came with some of the cross that i felt compelled to offer it to you guys so that's how so like okay so like this week i can go ahead rinse this out start all the way over i can put my bun back up you know spray it put my ponytail back up wrap it back up and i'm good for another week or I can just go ahead and do a dry clean right now and get everything out and start over that way. So those are our options um, as far as our weekly hair stuff. Now, my scalp does not itch because when I put my family hair care on, let me go ahead and put my hair back in the ponytail so you guys can see. When I put my product on, my hair... A lot of, you don't put, just put it on your hair. This is also good for your scalp. So we're going to go ahead and when I apply, so if I wake up tomorrow morning and I got like some fuzz right here, I didn't sleep in my um, night, you know, hair wrap or whatever, and I got some fuzz, I'm going to go ahead and not only slick that hair down, but when I'm putting my product on, I want it to be cold on my scalp because I'm feeling it being applied to my scalp also. So it's like oh i feel it like not only over my hair but also directly on my scalp and that's how you restore your scalp and keep your scalp healthy um mm -hmm. that's it. when your scalp is itching and you want some relief don't scratch it you know what i'm saying just go ahead take it 
put it, rub it down to the scalp and rub it. Okay, let me get it in there. Let me get it moisturized. Let me get it smooth. Let me go ahead, that sensitive area, and smooth it out. Does that make sense, guys? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And all in one product. This is patent pending. Yes. It's a this is the future of hair care. If you don't know, you will know very, very, very soon. But, <laughs> I'm sorry. I said speak it. That's oh, right. thank you so much. Yep. So okay, so in doing my bun, I can go a whole nother couple of weeks. You know what I'm saying? I can go ahead and wash my hair today. It's all over. We have all those options. But the key is you have to add enough at the outset so that you have some on your hair at the end of the week if my hair was looking like this when i first got done and it's wash day how, there's nothing for me to wash out you know what i'm saying i don't have enough product but if i if i have these curls you know what I'm saying? you can have these on day one and you can have these on day 30. if this starts to get frizzy take some more product and run it down the curl again and let it dry and it's just like this it has never gotten any easier and let me tell you guys another thing why i don't like the, the like I used to buy hair systems and like when you buy hair systems, you they come with like maybe three to five products. You might find maybe one or two good ones out of the three to five and then you run out of this one or two and you got to order the whole system again. It's just like two. It's just like way too much. One product, it does everything. I can cleanse my hair. You know what I'm saying? I don't have to have any shampoo. I don't have to have any deep conditioner, any pre-poo, any of that stuff with just one hair product and i was balding i grew my hair i was balding in the front i went for a hair transplant to a doctor to, for a consultation he called me this was years ago between 10 and twelve thousand dollars it was going to be a very very painful he told me i would have black eyes they're going to take hair out the back of my hair pluck them and then insert them in the front and then it was going to fall out after a couple of weeks or months and then they would have to grow back in so you still gonna be looking crazy. It's just a whole process. Um, and I grew my hair with one hair care product and I'm offering it to you guys right now. And it does everything. And what it doesn't do, we give you the education to do. So um, that's it for my bun demonstration tonight. This hair was done three weeks um, ago. I have a question for you guys. Should we go longer before we wash or should we wash now? How are you guys feeling? Y'all wanna see how long we can go with our hair looking good without washing? Or should we just go ahead and wash and just go ahead and start yes. start anew? Go longer. Okay. So, yep. <laughs> go longer. Well, really, really quick. We're going to go longer. Let me just go ahead and do this while I got y'all on the phone. We're going to go ahead and wrap this back up right now. I'm going to go ahead and put a little water in it because I don't want to have too much product to where it's just, you know. So, I'm going to go ahead and wet it. And we can monitor this, guys. Uh, let me go ahead and wet this and put this back up for you. Okay, so I'm I'm not gonna take our time to do it right now. I was gonna go ahead and just wrap back up and everything. I'm not gonna do that right now. But y'all, I have never had hair like this before. I used to look at people with hair like this and be so envious. Oh my god, like my hair could never do that. My hair could never do that. And you guys that did nine day hair challenge, can you kind of talk to the people who don't really know about it and let them know all the things that you guys were able to do after that you guys were not able to do prior? Does anybody want to speak? Please. Well, I, for me, I can say one thing. Oh, mm -hmm. go ahead. Okay. I can say, like, this hair product is definitely God sent um, from you, Emery. Thank you. Like, they're, they're, oh, wow. So I cast it earlier this week. Don't have to cast all week. Mm -hmm. You know, I can literally just get up and go. And I just love the flexibility of that. Thank you. So, yep. So, and um, how, how has casting helped your hair? It has definitely given the shine. Uh-huh. And I don't have, like, any of the, the flyaways because mm -hmm. I do have some, some gray in the front. Okay. And so they're they're beginning to behave. Yay, you're, you're, <laughs> you're training them like, like the other kids. Yes. <laughs> yes. Okay, good. Yes yeah good see even with this product you can just play with your hair and do crazy stuff and make it look good and like i was telling you guys about um the casting too you don't have to like just cast like really slick on your scalp you can have a nice 
the, we're going to start doing some, like, we're going to take it to the next level. I'm trying to give everybody the chance who did not participate in the challenge to catch up. So um, let me go ahead and show you guys that right now, really, really quickly for all you guys um, who have not yet participated in the challenge and don't know quite about, give me one second. Justin and some family hair care, and I'll be good to go. So if you have not, you know, our website is down below. Go ahead and check that out. That's what we're using today. Um, it's a homemade formula, um, all natural ingredients, and it's vegan friendly. Okay. So do we have any questions or anything from, okay. the, from the bond doing to the product to anything at this time, family? Any questions? Let me say the same. Please. It's hey, I haven't seen you. Hi. How are you doing? I'm good. good. I just have to say this. I just love this part of you. I don't know if you can see me, but I just love looking at my hair. Yeah. And then for a week. Okay. I just get up and just put more stuff on it. And it's still and shiny. It's still it shiny. It's so good. Yeah. So I've just been creating and my hair feels good when I wash it. Just I'm in the mirror like talking to myself like oh my gosh seriously this is what my hair is doing this right now okay i'm with it it's hard for so, me to great believe product. Too. i love it and let me tell you my friend she started making some hair oil and she said would you try my hair oil and i'm like oh i said what's in it <laughs> and i said but i'll try it i'm in this challenge right now mm -hmm. i just had to tell her like everything i'm in this challenge right now so as soon as i'm done i'll try it but I just don't want to put anything else in my hair. So, well, thank you. Uh, yep, thank. And that's I think that's where I went wrong too. I used I've always made my own hair products, but then when someone famous came out with the product, or when okay, we have a lot of people who share. Keep sharing, guys. I'm about to pick a winner in a few minutes. Um, 
we will go ahead and give you a fifty dollar gift card. But when I would like try these hair waxes, these pomades, all this stuff, that stuff like would really like do damage to my hair for like weeks. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't just like oh I rinse it out and, and you know it was just like so. I definitely found something that worked well consistently, and I'm sticking mm -hmm. with it. So yeah, definitely. Yeah. Me too. <laughs> okay, Me too. great, 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 great. Okay, uh, good. All right, anybody else have anything they want to go ahead and say? You can just go ahead and talk. It's talk. It's all good. I just want to say I'm so thankful that I found this product. Emory, you have nothing to worry about. There's <laughs> nothing on the market that can touch you and your education, the whole schooling process of how to do from beginning to end. There's no other product out there that have a glossary of things to do and how to do with the product and different hairstyles and different scalp condition and, and it just you cover everything well, thank you so Even much with my hair i started out i was really bald through here from my bangs to back here mm -hmm. i could hold my little hair up and i can see straight through and see my scalp shine and i was freaking out and i was like lord i don't want to grow old and bald and by the grace of God, I was at church one day and I saw a young lady standing there and I asked her, I said, your hair is beautiful. And she said, it is called photogenics. <laughs> I'm like, photo. So I started to write it down. She said, no, don't just write it down. Go home and look it up. This was three years ago. Okay. I came home, making a long story short, I came home, looked it up online. She said, when you look it up, call me and let me know. I came home and I placed my order. Then I called her. I said, I like what I saw. Since I've been using the product religiously for three years, I have hair, thick hair. It's not long yet. I don't want long, long hair. But <laughs> I just didn't want to grow old and bald. Yes. My hair, the texture of my 4C hair has changed tremendous. It is soft. I got soft hair now. I can start out with one style and get up in the middle of the night and just rearrange it and come out with a totally different style. Now, I was bonding, like I call it my Mr. Ebon. Yeah. I'm like, okay, I'm retired. I don't have to change my hair every day like everybody else. So I'm like, I'm going to switch it up now. I'm going to turn around and show you the back of my head. I played ping pong today for an hour and a half. I've cut grass. I rake leaves. I filled in ditches. With this head right here. Haven't wow. done anything. I don't know what it looked like, but here it goes. It looks really good. It's perfect. Yeah, it's perfect. It looks amazing. All that work out in the yard with my family hair care product. And I got my little twist things. I'm going to change it up, but I just love, love, love it. And Beautiful. It's, it's everywhere. I love it. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Yeah, that's awesome. Can I say something? Can I ask a please, question to Erica? Please. Erica, yeah. I just want to know, is that your hair or helper hair? That's it's my hair. Hey! <laughs> oh my goodness. Well, that, that you looking fine. Look at yes. that. And speaking of helper oh, hair, we're gonna give a shout out to Lisa. Lisa, come up here and show everybody your casted. <laughs> Just put up. Just show everybody your 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 your, your casted hair. Hang on one second. The bun guys. under this hair. <laughs> Can you guys see us? So she has her bun, and you it's just so easy. You want you big? Oh, hang on one second. Let me come in here. Give me one uno momento, por favor. Okay. There we go. How? Okay. It's just a bun with hair wrapped around. <laughs> so oh, so pretty. But it's just super, super simple, you know what I'm saying? And this is stuff that traditionally a lot of people go to the hair salon to do. And you can just do it with just this, you know what I'm saying? It's just super, super easy. Uh, it makes life a lot easier for everyone. Okay. Um, let me go ahead and... Uh, okay. All right. Does anybody else have anything else they want to go ahead? Um, any comments, any questions or anything? Before we get into that, um, I see we have a couple of people who share... I'm gonna go ahead and pick a winner in just a second. Let me go ahead and read the read the comments, and then I have a couple of questions that were emailed in. I'll read those, and then we'll be good to go for today. Okay, guys. Um, okay, I'm watching while cooking. 
Hey, Bridges, show. Okay, I'm not allowed to. I wanted you. to say something. Please. Hey, how are you? Monica? I'm good. How are you? Good. Awesome. Good to see you. So, what I noticed about my hair, like, I, I like to have my the showers coating. Mm -hmm. So, I really don't have to do much. When I get out, my hair is, like, nice and moisturized and everything. And it just falls into some beautiful, like, my, the tech, the color of my hair, it, it automatically naturally looks dry. But I noticed that it. I don't have that problem anymore. Mm -hmm. And like, I don't have to really do anything. I can just, you know, and, and go. And it's so curly and so shiny and gorgeous just from taking a hot shower. And I absolutely love that. That's awesome. That is. And remember at one point in time, we used to be afraid to get our hair wet. Mm. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, you can say that again. Wow. Okay, guys. So let me go ahead. Um, Bridget, you've been doing really, really good with your steps and everything. Um, I can't see or hear anything. So let me just let, let you guys know. Um, um, next week, we're going to stop doing the Zoom calls. We're going to bring everything over to Restream. So if you guys want to cam up, we're going to send you a video link invitation to do so. So we all won't be on Zoom. We'll all be on here so that everybody can see everything together and we all can get the full benefit. So I'll go ahead and send it out to everybody in the P-Hives. You guys can come up because a lot of people couldn't hear some things um, on the main page. And that's fine. We'll look out for you guys next week. Okay. Um, you're giving me hope. Please have some hope. Um, if you try the product, just trust the process. If you need help, come to our group. We are all there every day. That's the first thing I do in the morning is going to the hair group. So we help. Like if you need help, we're there to help. There's a plethora of content. We have a whole tutorials page on our website with every hair type. And if you don't see your hair type, you can request it and we'll get it made, you know, for you. Okay. My hair is mostly white, silver. And no matter how much I rub the product between my palms, I'm noticing that my hair is getting an orangey tint. Okay. Um, someone from church turned me on also. I'm just beginning to use the product. Awesome. Good for church. Okay. If your hair is white and you just want to, uh, okay, I think we mentioned this last week. What you may want to do is... Um, you might have to put quite a bit on your hair to get the desired look. So you can do this in, in a couple of ways. When you're applying it and you want to rub it white, you don't want to apply it in a large increment. You want to apply it in small increments. And then you want to make sure that you rub it in the palm of your hands and that when you put it on your hair, it's actually white and see-through. So when I put it on my hair, I'm seeing it white not brown so and that's only done if you do it in very small increments um when you put it in on in a, a large quantity it's kind of hard to rub white because inevitably there'll be some at the edge of your hand or something that getting didn't get rubbed in just do it in real small quantities and rub it white if that doesn't work what i recommend you do is put it on full strength very very brown uh put you on a uh plastic cap at night um, you know, really condition your hair so that they all start to train and lay together and then just rinse it out the next day. And then you have to put very, very little on then because you decondition it and it has a lot of moisture in it. And then that way, you once you rinse it out, all the brown is gone, put more white in to bring it back. But you have those nutrients in there that were, you know, uh, because you did a really good deep condition the night before. Does that make sense, guys? Yes. Okay. I just want to make sure because people with the, with the light color hair, they always have that issue. I think it's because they either apply, like you can apply as much as you need for your hair, but you have to apply it in small increments because if you don't, uh, inevitably some of it will get on brown. Or, you know what I'm saying, just go ahead and apply it full strength, slick everything down, even though stubborn hairs, and then the next day you rinse it out. It's going to be well, well, well more moisture and behave. Okay. Um, it's beautiful. I love it. Really gorgeous. Okay. Uh, my first time joining Ready to Grow My Hair and Fall in Love Family Hair Care. Please, the more the merrier. And we're in our group every day. Right now, we're focusing on our hair health and our health health. But next month, the month of February, we're focusing on our financial health. So it's Get Money February. So we're going to be looking good while doing it, okay? So uh, let me go ahead and keep going. Um, I love to get my hair wet so they can see my curls popping. Yes. Uh, reply. Okay. Um, I can't hear. Da, 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 da. Okay, great. Now let me go ahead to these other comments. And then Erica, love your background. Can you do one for me? Not tech savvy. Erica, they love the family hair care background, boo. 
Okay. Um, I like your help of hair, Lisa. Thank you. Okay. I brag so much about family hair care that my daughter asked me if they pay me. Yes, we pay you in great hair and a great family environment. Okay. Hey, happy new year. I've been busy with work. Um, but I was able to braid my hair with helper hair for the first time with PAC, protective style, and I am so grateful. Moisturizing and putting on my scalp while it's in braids. Excited to take down soon. That's awesome. Especially for the first time. Yeah, we're doing things that we were never able to do before. So proud of you guys. Okay. Clara, yes. Keep bragging. Yes. Thanks so much for bragging about us, too. Hello, everyone. Now my umbrella. Okay. All right, guys. So that's pretty much it for this week. I'm not going to hold you guys. Let me go ahead and go through these questions really quickly. Um, one question. Okay. So, okay, guys, it's about to get a little bit serious. So I'm going to need you guys to chime in too. Um, before I answer, I'm going to give you guys an opportunity to answer. Okay. Um, okay. So the anniversary of the death of my son who died in the avalanche on February 2nd, 2021 is coming soon. In the last two months, I have had substantial, a substantial amount of hair loss, and I need all the help I can get. Help. Okay. So does anybody, okay, I'll let RP Hive go ahead and chime in first. You know, um, does anybody have any, you know, based on the education that we have worldly and through our hair care product, does anybody have any resolutions for um, the writer? Emery, this is Rhonda. Hi, Rhonda. Hi, hi guys, hi Lisa. Hi. Um, she didn't put too much details on in that um question because is she still? I mean, the loss of a son, she's probably still stressing. Mm -hmm. So it could be something. Uh, I don't want to mentally that she's still mm -hmm. taking on stuff because stress allows you. Stress causes your hair to um fall yeah, out. Yes, it does. It does because. You know, I'm studying and my hair, <laughs> it has to fall out. I'm so glad because I have family here because it's not falling out and mm -hmm. I'm doing everything not to stress. But I think it is, it has to do with her stressing. She probably needs to look at her diet and I mean, if she's using family hair care daily, um, it could be something other than products that she's putting in her hair. It could be internal. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Could be an internal factor. Yeah, but I'm so sorry, you know, so sorry that she lost her son. That's 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 sad and everything, and I need to think about it all the time. Yeah, you are gonna think about it, but I think I think it is internal stress that she has. Okay, I just want to say firstly to the writer, my condolences. I know that it must be. I mean, my grandmother told me this when I was young: the worst pain you could ever experience in life is losing a child. So I can just only imagine, you know, especially right now with everything else going on. I just want to offer my condolences to you and your loved ones. Um, the second thing I want to mention is to go ahead and put your hair in a cast. Protect your hair. Like, like you know, like I have mine in a, in a bun. Wrap it up, protect it, and make sure that your scalp is nourished and moisturized. And that from the outside is what I recommend. If your hair is fragile because of stress, you don't want to manipulate it. You want to go ahead and put it in a style that's going to go ahead and look good for you, but also offer you, you know, some protection. And um, that's just one less worry for you to have to deal with every day. Um, the third thing I want to say is do things that bring you joy and remind you of your son. I mean, just because mm -hmm. he's not here does not mean that there's not a yearning for that bond. Um, you know, so just do things that bring you joy and make you happy. A fourth thing I want to say is, you know, when things dramatic happen in our lives, you can't be the same person with the same routine that you were before that happened, just minus that. You have to kind of alter other things in your life. If I come home and used to sit right here every day, I'm going to look there every day. I'm going to feel away every day. I want to kind of like just switch it up. You know what I'm saying? Do different things to honor you. You know what I'm saying? You know, maybe I want to go out and get, you know, some fresh air, get some new environments, just do things that are different because the same routine without with everything the same without him just being there, just, you know, you living how you were with a hole there. So just try to switch it up. You know what I'm saying? And it can be anything, you know, I'm going to, you know, 
do some, you know, work on this. I'm going to do this that I always wanted to do. I always wanted to start this career. I always wanted to, you know, move here. I always wanted to visit here. Or I finally get to go visit my friend here. Just things that are different that you wouldn't, you know, do or that, that you didn't do before because you have to kind of alter your life or else it's just going to be that way. It's going to be so much more difficult for you to get um, over the hump. And then mm -hmm. lastly, the, the fifth thing I want to say is, you know, mental health is very, very, very real. So find someone who you can speak to candidly. Find someone who, when you feel like you're at a low, they can, you know, bring you up. And that's whether it's just somebody just, I just want you just to listen. That's one event. Or somebody here, I do you have any resources or or even if it's a therapist, you know what I'm saying? It can be your pastor, just somebody who you can really, really talk to on a one-to-one -one level, intimately, consistently, because it's hard to, like, when you're going through something and you need help, I have to go ahead and talk to a brand new person and explain the whole background before I can get to the help I need to get. So just getting that support system, you know, for your mental health, I think is equally important, especially if your stress is being caused internally, you know, the things that we do out externally for our hair, you know, they will help, but you want to go ahead and get to the root of the issue and work on that because uh, Nikolai Machiavelli, you know, a famous philosopher once said, you know, illness at the, at the outset is very um, difficult to, to see and diagnose, but it's usually very easy to cure. And as the illness progresses, it's way, way, way more easy to identify and more difficult to cure. So when you have things, you know, that you can see being potentially problematic in the future, just try, you know, I'm going to put something in place to if I can't, you know, let me, let me just give you as an example. Before I started family hair care, I worked at a law firm. I was single, um, you know, I live by myself and I just had worries about, hey, if I get sick one day, who's going to take care of me? If I can't work anymore, how am I going to go ahead and live? And what I did was I talked to my HR person I set up, you know, a package. So if I got, you know, sick and I couldn't work, I had insurance for that. If um, I got sick, you know, and I had to go to a home or something, I had insurance for that. If I got injured, you know, I had to just make sure that all these different scenarios in my life that could happen, that could like end me or alter because I like how I live. I tried to protect that, you know, and then so, you know, that's just like planning ahead for things like especially if you have like these worries, you know, try to get ahead of that stuff. See what options are out there. And if you can't, if it's not feasible to you right now, this is what I need to work towards in the future. And then also building a good support system, somebody who I can talk to and feel vulnerable without my business being on the Internet two days later. You know what I'm saying? So mm -hmm. it's just about and somebody who can actually give me some good advice. Nobody wants to have a pity party when I'm down and you down and we down together you know what i'm saying you need somebody that's going to bring you up cheer you up speak some life into you and you know we kind of tell everybody here if you're not feeling your best come to our group that's what we're here for to bring that cheer and you know to bring that vibe you know to your life so that's my advice um ladies does anybody else want to go ahead and chime in and give any uh suggestions I was going to also say um, about the, the casting because I don't know if y'all remember. I went to my hairdresser and she cut all my hair off. You, I, I do like, remember it. So I forgot all about that now because it grew back. Yeah, it grew back. So, and, and I know that it's because of that product, but I, I have to say when I start casting my hair and just wearing it in a bun for one, it's protected. It's not, you know, hanging and getting caught on things. And so that helps. It's sleeping on it and stuff like that. I, just in the past three months, it grew a lot in my hair, but during this challenge, my hair grew so much. And that's because most of the time I keep it like this. Occasionally, I'll get out the shower and just like a couple of days ago, I had it just out early. Mm -hmm. It looked so pretty when I got out. But most of the time, it's in this bun. And let me tell you how much it has grown since then, how yes. it's shiny. It doesn't look like yours. When I am. It don't look like that yet. I'm working on it. No, that. no, no. But like, seriously. But it's there. My hair gets so long, I'm like, I just wear it in the bun. Let me just cut this off because it's like when I stretch it all the way out, I still have like inches left. I'm like, I'm not doing all that. I just cut it off I'm like every couple of months. But it's so super easy to grow your hair this way. And I try to like stress to people, if you try everything else and it didn't work, try this. This is, is, is the solution. The girl part is great. I want those weights. <laughs> yep. This, 
add more, you know what I'm saying? Add more, you know what I'm saying? And we we wake up in the morning and you know, just add more until you get the desire. Like every day, like when you first wash your hair, you want to apply heavily. But inevitably, the following day is going to be, um, you know, if you wake up, hey, I want more shine. I want more waves. You add more. Add it to you feel it down on your scalp at the same time. Everything's going to dry together and it's going to wave up for you. So just keep adding a little bit more and you'll be good to go. Um, someone said, can you use it every day? I really don't have to use it every day. I use it. So I wash my hair maybe like once every four to six weeks. I apply it really, really heavily on wash day, put my hair in the bun. The next day I might wake up and I have to apply it to my scalp only, not my bun. Um, and then like the third day is just usually a touch up. And then after that, maybe like once a week, I take down my bun and refresh it. But other than that, that's it. A jar of family hair care lasts me for about a little less than a month, but I don't have my side hair. So um, some people say they run through like, you know, two or three jars a month in their household because they have a lot of curly hairs and stuff. Curly hair people are using it. Some people say they use one jar and it lasts them for six months to eight months. So it kind of just depends on you whether you want to use it every day or not, but you really don't have to. Uh, I don't. And then someone said, okay, uh, we only couldn't hear when you switched over when you were discussing the challenge that ends on the 31st. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, guys. Okay. I'm sorry about that. Um, okay. What happens if you whip the product with an electric mixer when it turned white? It may uh, turn, it will turn lighter, but it's going to sit. And I prefer to just do it as I'm doing my hair. Small increments. That way you can, it's white. You're putting it on your hair. It's looking white. You know what I'm saying? You can do it that way. Many people say that they have, but you don't have to do it that way. People say, hi, Rhonda. Okay, you can get a steamer for your gray hair that will penetrate the product in your hair. So for the person who had the gray hair and they said that they have an issue, um, a suggestion is you can get a steamer and you can steam your hair and it'll allow the product to penetrate your hair much better. So you can, you can use much less product and you won't have the brown, okay? And then casting, um, people gave the lady advice to cast. Um, anyone ever needs someone to talk to, never hesitate to message me. I'm here and I see you. And that's from Miss Bridget Shaw, who coincidentally, we just picked our winner for the share and she was our winner. So Bridget, you won a $50 gift card. Thanks so much for your kind heart and offering, you know, for people who need someone to talk to, you know, so and you're in our family hair care group. So, okay. I'm um, replying to a Facebook user. If you whip it long enough, it will turn a real light beige. Yep. So if you rip it long enough, it'll turn a light beige. But if you want to rub it white, I recommend doing it in small increments in your hand. Okay. So can I chime in? This is Renee Knight and I actually have white hair. Hi, Renee. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Um, I actually have white hair okay. and or gray hair or whatever you want to call it. And I absolutely love using it, um, using the product, rubbing it in. I don't do small increments. First of all, I don't want to be doing my hair. Okay. So, I, okay. You know, <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't care. I don't want to take my time doing a little bitty increments because I do have hair on my head. It's a lot of hair. And yes. It's just too much work. So I just rub it in. For me personally, I like the little tint because it actually looks like I have highlights in yes. my hair. And I do get compliments. I have I see how people look at my head and it's like, hmm, do, you know, I'm sure they're wondering if I've done, you know, it, it's expensive to do those, um, what do you call those streaks or whatever yeah. you know, the highlights. And so yeah. it looks like highlights in, in my head actually. And then my curls, um, they're they're basically like a um highlighted goldish looking color. Mm -hmm. But if I don't want it like that, I will put on a plastic um what do you call it, plastic cap or bag or whatever, and just kind of let the heat from my head, um, I guess it, it sort of changes color. It, okay. it, it looks like it goes away. So it, it, it doesn't stay highlighted um, the entire time my hair is either in a ponytail or down or whatever. I, 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 it, I get rid of it by using a, a plastic cap. So um, yeah, I just wanted to share. It does work for me. It works very well. I um, initially, when I started using it, I wasn't using enough but after of course the 90 day hair challenge and looking at all the videos and you know just kind of following what everyone else has been doing it looks like, like i have a perm now and i have not had a perm in since i don't know 30 something years that's so awesome i'm actually loving my hair <laughs> 
great. I'm I'm so happy to hear that. That is really really awesome. Uh, and I especially love to hear people who are uh, um of like older who like have never had these results all their life. You know, so that is like really just amazing to me that we're able to bring this you know to you guys. And I have never had a job or career that was so fulfilling. And like you like you guys know, I'm a lawyer. I uh, I have like several degrees. I've worked in several different industries, and this is just like the best job for me to work with you guys and to educate you. And we're all learning together. So um, I'm going to go. This is the best group, actually. This is the best hair group that I ever been in. I, I'm on other groups in on Facebook, and it's not all positive. You know, you hear people talking about each other's hair, and I'm like, okay, this is. I, I kind of passed through, but this has been the most positive group that I've actually been a part of. And I'm so thankful for all of the ladies and the, the knowledge, you know, sharing how they get their hair looking so nice. Because a lot of people don't want to share how good their hair looks. They don't. I mean, how their hair, you know, there's those on the side that she's probably got perm and she ain't saying nothing and she's mm -hmm. just using product and, you know, that kind of stuff. But I love the positivity in this group and I love you for everything that you're, you've done and that you continue to do to make us um, grow and grow in the way we do. So thank you. Henry. Thank you so much. And I, I did the same thing too. Like people were like, oh, okay, well maybe you're, you draw your hairline in because your hairline would be so perfect. Or maybe uh, you uh, got a fake ponytail in because your bun always be together. It's just one hair product, like there, and that's why I try to just take it down to step by step with you guys. And if you are curious as to, hey, I don't know anything, you know, uh, how can I do this from scratch? Join the 90 Day Hair Challenge also on our tutorials page. Casey Marie, she did a big chop and started with no hair and grew her hair in and shows you guys those tutorials. So we have all that information for you guys. Um, really quickly here, Bridget Shaw is the winner. Thank you so much for sharing, Bridget, Bridget, Bridget. Um, a couple more comments. Um, awesome advice, Emery. I hope she's listening. Grief counseling is important. Grief counseling is very important also. And there are a lot of groups for people who have lost people to be able to talk to each other and, you know, um, heal um, in that manner too. Emery, you are so well-rounded in every aspect. Um, journaling all is a way of comforting also. Journaling is also a great way to write it down and get it out. And then you can go ahead and reference it at a later point. Because sometimes you go back and read that, you were like, oh, I wrote that I was at a really, really low point. So that is a really, really uh, great suggestion, Renee. Uh, great info, Emery. Thank you so much. Um, is that all of Lisa's hair, or does she have a, a piece in it? She has a, her, her helper hair in. Yeah, she is not Vesta up in here. Shaka Khan, Shaka Khan, Shaka Khan. Okay. <laughs> okay, it's helper hair. Yep, Denise, it's it. Okay. Thanks. Okay. Uh, okay, guys. Awesome group. Love it here. We are here to help each other. It takes a village. It does. So I'm going to let you... Hey, hey, I love that Emery won't allow the negative. No, no negativity here. We have that all over the internet, all over the streets. I just feel like, guys, we are living in comparison to maybe like 10, 15 years ago, we are living in an HBO Cinemax world. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's like everywhere you go, you see everything, you hear everything, you know, there's no filter. So I just want to have one place where we can all come. No shade. I need help with my hair. You can actually reach out to somebody. Hey, what did you do to get your hair like this? And they actually answer without trying to judge you or make fun of the situation. So we don't have that at all. And then I get up here. I come here every day. I'm not coming here to argue with nobody. That's just not happening. I don't want you to come here to argue with nobody. So if you don't know how to act, we come here and we do a lot for nothing you know we give you education for free we make i come make my product available for you to go your hair if you have any issues you know what i'm saying and we're not going to sit up here and just be beat down you know for doing it so if we don't have that you know we had it you know a little bit early on but we just 100 percent said we weren't going to tolerate it and it hasn't been an issue so that's awesome okay guys we are all good to go this week it's been an hour, an hour in i want to thank you all for coming on this week and i'm going to let you guys um go Everybody have a positive week. Um, keep posting your health goals in the group. And then next week, I want everybody to come with a money-making mindset. For the month of February, we want to go ahead and discuss. Right now, we are in the middle of a uh, pandemic, okay? We all know that. So when we're at home and the ends aren't meeting and the worries are surmounting, we want to go ahead and have very, very, very attainable methods of getting money. 
How can I start a business? How can I work from home and make an hourly wage? You know what I'm saying? How can I, uh, it's all kinds of things that, you know, that you can do, you know what I'm saying? And we're going to go ahead and show you, tell you some of those things and share with you. And we're going to share some tips so like how you can look, you know, well while doing it with great hair and a smile on your face and be positive. So that's pretty much all we have uh, for this week. Thank you guys for coming on. And I'll see you all next week. Love you all. Thank have you so week. much. Love you guys. Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye. Good night, everybody. Good night. Bye. 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 Love you. Love you guys. Hi, Auntie. I love you so much. Love you too.